psychology in practice. Um, in the face of adversity. Um, a new note. I had one yesterday on and for Noel, his father. Um, a wonderful, wonderful friend. Um, and um, uh, there are obviously some negative, perhaps depressing thoughts, but there is also something to be gained from this. Um, one, I said yesterday there is a need to, to understand better uh, the luck that I had to have that background. Then, to appreciate more his son, who's sick by the way, so, well, we hear that, uh, there's the father gone sick and terminally ill, and now there's a son. Well, hopefully, inshallah, this is just a passing thing, but, um, it, it, it's part of the struggle where we need to be strong. In fact, uh, psychology, not just positive psychology, but psychology is analyzing various um, strengths that we need, mental uh, abilities and skills, and it turns out that we... Of course, it's good to be intelligent, I guess. I'm not that, in, that intelligent to... to see this so well, <laughs> but EQ, emotional intelligence, is much more important. And um, again, at this moment, I see that I, I did not uh, perform well, so to say, in this department, because um, while I had him, um, I wasn't so aware of how kind, how gentle, how noble this guy was. Uh, now I sort of see him coming. He had this dancing move, well, that gracious, noble, out there with the Afghan, among the noblest of all dogs. In fact, uh, speaking of the negative side, because the point here is not just uh, all milk and honey, all let's be positive, positive, it could be well done in a note, positive, positive, optimistic, op optimistic, and that's it. No, it's, the, the effort here is to try and understand, I'm, I'm trying to see the truth, uh, to find the Holy Grail myself, Nirvana, uh, flow, bliss, maximum happiness. But in the process, there are, negative experiences, some of them tragic, like this one, which I need to, to, to get over, but also try and understand and hopefully, again inshallah, experience PTG, post-traumatic growth, instead of post-traumatic stress disorder, which is so often the case. And, um, the negative of, of, of having been with this guy is that um, I, I didn't I didn't see him at his real value. In fact, at the end, when indeed he was bleeding all over the place and he couldn't move, and it was you know, when he, he, I remember this moment when in one of his last few days, couple of days maybe even, uh, he came to me, but with his bleeding mouth because he was. He had cancer, but the mouth and uh, it was it was bad. And he leaned against me as I was going out somewhere in the city, and, and, and I was upset. What? Why are you doing? What are you doing? You're ruining. I mean, you're ruining my pants and all that. So, um, of course, such things happen. Uh, that's. That's 
I'm returning to the motive for doing this. this I, I try and, and explore the side, try and eliminate negative thoughts. The, the Buddhists say you can't have positive when you have negative. That's true, you can't have them at the same time. So negative thoughts can be, need to be as much as possible um, sanitized, so to say, expelled. And when there's no way, um, just try and see what the benefit is. One of the, one of the good things for this end of this good friend is that he stopped suffering. And if Buddhists and others are, are, are right, he's, he's, he's gone to another sphere. And eventually, referring to the Buddhists, he will come back as a as a good, uh, good man, a woman. So, um, again, I need to be grateful for what he offered me, including his son, down there, there, which I need to cherish and value more.